Let us understand how to install Minikube as a part of CentOS operating system. Already I do have the Docker installed. Let me verify the status of the Docker. sudo docker info. The Docker service is running and the runtime that I am using is container D. Now I am going to do the installation of Minikube. Minikube needs to have a separate user and the user needs to be added as a part of the super user group that is wheel. And we have to make sure the Minikube is also part of the Docker group. To do that, I am going to add and create a user called Minik. Let me make myself as root. I am going to add user Minik and I will set the password for the user. Yes, the password is set. Now I am going to add this specific mini k user as a part of the wheel group. Let me make myself as the Minikube user. Now I have logged in as a Minikube user. I am going to create a group called Docker and add the user Minikube as a part of the Docker group. sudo group and Docker. Already that group is existing. So I will go ahead and add the Minikube user as a part of the Docker group. I will be adding the user Minik as a part of the Docker group with the command sudo user mod dash a g docker Minik. Yes, all the settings are done. Now I am going to restart the system or log off the user and log in again. Restarted. Let me log in. Either I can log in as a Minikube or any other user and change the user as Minikube user created dedicatedly for the Minikube. Now I am going to download the Minikube installation. So this is the URL. Don't worry about the commands. I will be adding all the commands that I am using as a part of the description. Download is done. I am going to install Minikube. sudo install Minikube installer into the location user local bin Minikube. Now I can verify whether the installation is good or not using the command Minikube. Yes. The installation is successful. Now I can start my own local cluster, delete them, access the dashboard, do whatever I want.